Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I am Bearded Fortech. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. This is a 2022 Transit. This is the rear brake. Um, I'm gonna go over what was going on with this. It has to do with a light that was on the dash. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, you see it right there. Floor of 2022. Um, 60 something thousand miles, I do believe. Yeah, 60. 2818 the light that was on the dash was brake pad low service now so how does it know if it's got worn out brake pads well here's the old this is the inner brake pad you can tell by the little little nippy nip and it has a sensor and that sensor plugs in right there well Here's my new brake pad, and that's some thick brake pads for the back, man, look at that. And there's the sensor. But if you look at it, if you look, see how it, see how it has that hump on it? See how it has this hump? This one does not. It's flat, it's even with the brake pad. That's because it was starting to wear down. And what it does is it breaks the connection inside here. It creates an it creates an open. And it sends a signal back up to the front of, hey, your brake pads are worn. So you're not metal to metal yet, but you're hitting, you're rubbing my sensor here, and it's time to replace it. And the new brake pads come with new sensors. So this thing being an electronic parking brake, you need to put it in brake service mode and you don't have to twist those. Let's see if I can get in with one hand. You don't have to twist. You can squeeze them in like normal. I like that. But you don't have to twist them. Anyway, you will have to put it in brake service mode. Turn the ignition on, press the, press the push button on the electronic park brake switch while pressing the brake pedal to release the brake. Release the brake pedal and the switch. Hold down the accelerator pedal and press the EBP switch. Continue to hold down the pedal and press the EBP switch. Turn the ignition off and back on within five seconds. Turn the ignition off. Release the accelerator pedal and the electronic park brake switch. Turn the ignition on. And it'll say brake service mode. Okay. And then to get out of it, you do the same thing. Okay, so I'm done with the brakes. I'm gonna turn this back on. So it says brake maintenance mode. I'm gonna be using the computer to take it out of brake maintenance mode, which I have right here. So I'm gonna say exit park brake maintenance mode. And it's going to adjust everything. Go down here, continue, continue. In ignition on, engine off. Ignition is on, engine off, see the little brake mode thing over there. So engine is off, ignition is on. Come back over here, continue. Vehicle is in park, the key is on, the engine is off, the parking brake is released, ensure the brake pedal is not pressed. I'm not pressing the park brake, or the brake pedal. You may be able to hear it. Check brake system. It is on. Cool. 
Come on, do your thing. There it goes. You hear it? Oh. Press brake firmly and retry. Using workshop manual. It, it did it. I don't know why it did that. It said check brake system and it said that it didn't exit out of mode, but it did because it took me right back here. But it's it's done. Oh, if you're going to do it manual without the computer, you hold the throttle to the floor, pull that, and you'll hear it apply, and then you step on the brake one time for one second. Uh, this application is finished and we're done and that is how you do the brakes with the brake pad sensor that's how you put it in brake service mode on this 2022 transit without yes you will have to step on the brake pedal when you take it out of brake service mode and you hold it for one second but uh, that is what a brake pad sensor is for it lets you know when your brake pads are low so you don't go metal to metal and uh, I love you guys appreciate it don't mind hitting that subscribe button and uh, head on over to Rainman Ray's Repairs and pick up a official Bearded Fortech merchandise. So, love you guys. See you on the next one.